What's going on, my crazy deals and steals family? I've got your midweek Walgreens haul for the deal starting February 23rd and running through February 29th. Let me apologize in advance. I am still sick. I do not feel well at all. So if I sound like crap or I just don't sound like myself, that's what's going on with that, okay? But I do have a midweek haul for you guys, and guess what? We did hit 9,000 subscribers before the end of February, so I am standing true to my promise that we will do a live Cash App giveaway the first week of March. I will do some thinking and planning, and we'll figure out when we're going to do it and the time. So make sure you guys hit that notification bell because I will be posting updates about this on the community tab. So you will not get that information if you don't hit that notification bell. So be sure to do that so you don't miss out, and as well, we are doing the next regular gift card giveaway at that 10,000 subscriber mark. Can we hit 10,000 subs by the end of February? I don't know. Definitely by the end of March. I'm sure we'll hit 10,000 subs by the end of March. So lots of stuff to look forward to as well as this haul. Everything you see right here is under $10 plus I made a whoopsies. So had I not made that whoopsies, this would have been maybe a dollar to 50 ish for everything you see right here. And we've got lots of paper products that we need for bundles, right? And I've got some clearance finds as usual. Well, you guys want to check these out and but without further ado let's get started with this midweek walgreens haul busy deals and steals family i've got your midweek walgreens haul right here you see i went um paper mate and sharpie slash expo crazy and no i did not get nine thousand packs of pencils because we don't need nine thousand packs of pencils but what we do need are these expo items and i'm gonna tell you why here in just a minute I also found this baby on clearance, some other things up there on clearance that I need for work. Um, lots of paper products because I'm running out of paper towels. As always, paper towels sell like crazy in bundles. And that's my crazy dog over there drinking an entire bowl of water as if she hasn't had water in a week and that is not true. <laughs> Sorry, they are slurping down the water tonight. Okay. Um, she's on prednisone. I'm sorry. He is on prednisone for his heartworm treatment. So that makes you super thirsty and super hungry all the time. So that's why he's over there guzzling down boatloads of water. Anywho, we're going to talk about some more clearance goodies. As you see, clearance, clearance, clearance. Um, yeah, so pretty great Walgreens haul. Walgreens is faring much better than CVS the last couple of weeks. And I'm pretty excited about it. So let's talk about these things right now. We're going to talk about that in-ad register reward booster and some things that regarding rolling points and getting the register rewards booster and all that fun stuff. Okay, so let's get into it one transaction oh, at Rock a time. Rock wants to say hi before... Hi, buddy. He wants to say hi. Hi, buddy. So he's doing good. He started his first um, series of heartworm treatment. So he's taking his oral steroid and antibiotic and all that good stuff right now, which is making him super thirsty and hungry. He's gained quite a bit of weight. What are you doing on your belly over there? Um, and then in, let's see, March, he's going to start his heartworm injection. And then once he done, he gets done with his heartworm treatments, he will be available for adoption. And he does have an interested adopter already. So just a little update on Rocky Boy over there. So I went ahead and took advantage at Walgreens of these items right here. I did not grab, like I said, 30 packs of pencils because I don't need those. But what we do need, we as in the Crazy Deals and Steals family, is these expo items. Reason being is that, remember, we've been talking a lot about the chalkboard wall in the vlogging area. And I was talking to my mom the other day and I got the chalk and everything to paint on the wall. And she was like, why don't you just do like a massive size dry erase board, right? Order one, special made, whatever you need to do. I was like, you know what? That might be okay. Like we can do that because I was just thinking about it. And you know what? I hate the feeling of chalk on my hands. Anytime I would write on a chalkboard, I would have to have gloves on real talk. Like I hate the feeling of chalk on my hands. It is like the thought of it makes me want to twitch you guys. It's just like the, like, you know, like nails on a chalkboard. I hate that. <clears throat> and also chalk on my hands. Like, ugh, no, 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 no. Yep. So anyway, what we're going to do instead is a dry erase board, a big one on the wall. It'll be easy to clean up, easy to write on. So I, I went ahead and took advantage of this deal in the ad right here. Um, and I got quite a few of these expo items um, and then the cleaner. And I got some erasers we're going to talk about here in a second. So with the deal on this, it's buy one, get one free, two, plus 2,000 points. Now, I don't know for sure if Walgreens meant to give you 2,000 points per pack that you buy. 
or if it's buy one get one free and get 2000 points you know you buy one you get one free and then get 2000 points per set i don't know it could possibly be they only meant to do it per set but it's kicking back 2000 points right now per item that you purchase so when you go to do this deal don't get 20 items you know 20 packs in one transaction just to start off test it out that's what i did i bought two right here buy one get one free here's my receipt these items were 349 they were buy one get one free and then you see down here i got back 4000 points so i got back 2000 points for this one and 2000 for this one so that was a little bit of like a 50 cent money maker once i verified through this that it was working and giving 2000 points back per set i went ahead and did a bigger deal all right and that would be this baby right here and we're going to also talk about rolling points to pay for our out of pocket regarding this in ad booster now when i tell you or ask you guys this i don't mean to be mean or anything like that but my question is regarding this in ad booster right spend 25 dollars, get a five dollar register reward this to me is not a spend deal like we would consider a spend $25, get 5,000 points. This is not giving us points. This is giving us a register reward. So why are people treating this as if it's a spend deal for points? Please answer this for me. I don't understand what's going on with that. Um, so no matter how many points I rolled in to pay for my transactions for this, I still got this register reward back. One transaction, I only rolled 2,000 points. I still got it. One transaction, I rolled 20,000 points. I still got this registry reward. So why are people treating this as if it's a spend for points deal? This is not a spend 25, get 5,000 points. You know, you know, on those, if it was a spend 25, get 5,000 points on a deal that's called spend deal, spend 25, get 5,000 points. I would advise you guys to not use points to pay because you will not get points back. However, this is a spend 25, get a $5 register reward. So let me know in the comments why people are treating this as if it's a spend 25, get 5,000 points deal. I'm confused. So anyway, these are the items that I paired in for this transaction right here, but we are missing a Snapple juice. Uh, my daughter wanted a Snapple juice, so I paired that in here. She's already drank it, obviously. So these are the things that I paired in, plus that Snapple. We've got the Expo spray right here for $4.99. They are buy one, get one free. Then we've got the Expo, I'm sorry, the Sharpie Fine Point Black Markers, which are these, buy one, get one free. Those babies are $3.79. Then we've got these bigger Sharpies, also $3.79, buy one, get one free. We've got the pencils right here, $2.99, buy one, get one free. And then we've got the pens right here, $2.99, buy one, get one free. And it is kicking back 2,000 points per package that you buy. So two, four, six, eight. 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. So 20,000 points are coming back <coughs> for this transaction right here. So we've got all these Expo Paper Made Sharpie items plus that Snapple. And then I added in a Bounty Essentials 6 equals 8 roll paper towel. Make sure it says Essentials on it. They are $4.99 on sale this week. And we've got a $1 digital. We also have a $1 coupon and our PNG from this past weekend, okay? <clears throat> so I used a $1 digital coupon on this. I did not have any coupons, manufacturer coupons for any of these paper mate or the Snapple item that I bought. So I'm going to show you guys my receipt real quick. I did roll 20,000 points. Here's the receipt. Doo -doo -doo. Okay. You see my $1 bounty digital. My total was $24. Um, with tax, it was 26. I rolled 20,000 points. I paid $6.40 out of pocket for these items. And like I said, I did get back 20,000 points, okay? So I spent 20,000 points, but I got 20,000 points back. So that knocks that out, free right, and these clear. These items right here were paired together for another spend $25, get a $5 register reward in the ad booster. And I got lots of clearance items right here. Let me first say, no, we do not have bed bugs. I repeat, we do not have bed bugs in this household at all. However, 
I do work with an underprivileged population and the majority of them do have bed bugs, roaches, things like that. Not that they're dirty people. That is not true. However, when you live in a apartment complex, um, and a lot of people live in that complex, one unit in your complex gets roaches or bed bugs. Guess what? The whole complex gets it. And the apartment complexes don't manage those things because what are they going to do? They're going to put everybody out, put everybody into a hotel room, tell everybody to take your stuff with you right? Then when they come back, their stuff that they take still has bed bugs, roaches, whatever. So they bring it all back into the complex. So apartment complexes in North St. Louis city don't manage issues like that. They just leave it up to the tenant to deal with it. Okay. So I don't want you guys to think that my, um, population that I work with are dirty or anything. They are not at all. However, somebody in your apartment gets roaches. Guess what? The whole plant complex is going to end up with roaches, unfortunately. So that's the reason I went ahead and grabbed these because they are underprivileged. A lot of times they might not have money to get spray or something like that. So I went ahead and grabbed this and um, I'll use that for work if and when that is needed. Um, it is on clearance. If you guys know someone that needs it or if you by chance need it, I totally get it. It is on clearance. Let me look at my receipt real quick and see. A dollar and thirty nine cents, you guys. Normal price thirteen ninety nine. A dollar thirty nine. Normal price thirteen ninety nine. If it is not tagged, have it scanned by your cashier. Here is the barcode. All right. These babies were also on clearance. Okay, a dollar and um. A dollar, shoot, where is it? Um, 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 here we go. 99 cents, I'm sorry. Okay, so 99 cents for these pooties. Get out of the pencils. My little dog is over there jumping around in the bags of pencils. Okay, so 99 cents for these babies right here. Uh, normal price is 9.99. So regular price, 10 bucks on clearance for 99 cents. Let's have these scanned as well at your store if they are not tagged. Okay, no coupons for these, you guys. Now, this baby we've been talking about on this channel and on our Instagram. You should be following us on Instagram if you are not already. They are on clearance for $1.19. I've grabbed quite a few of them over the last week or so. On clearance, $1.19, normal price $11.99. It's an off clip that will be sold in bundles this summer. You can clip it onto like a lawn chair, your pants, if you're going hiking, whatever. So this will be sold in this summer in bundles. And then I did grab the Cottonelle 12 equals 24 roll. We do have a fetch rebate. Look on your fetch discovery page, $1.25 back for these. So I'll get that back. We also have a dollar rebate on Ibotta that you can submit up to five times. So... I'll get that back on Ibotta as well. And then I had a 55 cent printable from VivaTowels.com that I used on this baby right here. And yes, you guys, I am sick. Oh, you guys, I do not feel good. I haven't felt good for days. So I'm trying to make it through this video real quick. Um, the Scott Paper Towels, I've got somebody that needs these in bundles. So I went ahead and grabbed two more packs of these. They are still buy one, get one half off. And I used a 50 cent printable from scottbrand.com on each one of these paper towel sets. So $5 for this one and $2.50 for this one for being half off. This I grabbed on clearance as well. It's a dollar and nine cents, you guys. So <coughs> normal price, $10.99. I do plan to sell this in a bundle as well. Um, so that's pretty cool. It is in the as seen on TV section and I also seen it in the shaving deodorant section. So there's the barcode on that baby. These right here are $4.99 as well as the um, six equals eight roll. Those are $4.99 as well. But this store that I was at, they were out of the six equals eight. So I went ahead and grabbed these. I checked to see if we had a digital. We do. Even though the digital is not supposed to attach to these in the app when I scanned it, it did attach. However, you always run the risk at the register if those are going to come off or not. It did not come off. I will tell you, even though it's attaching in the app, it is not coming off at the register. All right. And it is a $1 coupon. So I would advise you if your store has them to get the six equals eight rolls instead of the two equal five double plus. All righty. Okay, so I had all these items. I was hitting that $25 mark just by a teeny, teeny sminch, maybe like $25.20-ish cents or so. So I'm going to show you guys my receipt real quick. There's all of that, and you're going to see my, they scan that in, add register reward booster. 
And then here's all the coupons. I did roll $12 in register rewards. Those are all from the Crest deal. So I rolled $12 in register rewards. That made my total $12.50. I rolled 10,000 points. And guess what? 10,000 points redeemed. You see it right here. But I did get back that $5 register reward for the in ad register reward booster. Like I said, no matter how many points I rolled with that, I still got that register reward back. I don't know why people are treating this as if it's a spend deal for points, okay? So let's keep moving on. We're gonna go on to another transaction I right together now. in a transaction. And I will tell you ahead of time, I could have left these out. These are $2.99. I could have left these out and still been at $25.44 right here, but I was off on my math in the store. So I apologize about that. So you can actually, if you want to do everything right here, you can, but leave these out and you'll still be at $25.44. We've got the dual ended expo markers for $5.99. We've got the spray cleaner for $4.99. The dry erase board things for $4.99. I'm sorry, $3.99. Buy, you know, everything's buy one, get one free. And then we've got the highlighters right here for $3.49. And then we've got the... Paper Mate blue pens, $2.99. And then these, like I said, pencils were $2.99. So what I did was my total was $28.43 before tax. I rolled 20,000 points. I paid 10, right? But look, I got back 28,000 points plus that $5 register reward for the in-ad register reward booster. So I got back 28, 29, 31, to $33, but I only spent 30. I spent 20 in points and 10 out of pocket. So I spent 30, but I got back $33 in points and register rewards. So keep in mind, you're getting back 2,000 points per package. I don't know how long this is going to last until they change it or if they're going to change it at all. I don't know. So test the waters. Don't just bring all this stuff up to the register. Test the waters with, like, just say the cheap items. Get two of them. Check your receipt. Did you get 2,000 points or four? If you got back 4,000 points, 2,000 per pack, then that means you can go ahead and do a larger scale deal like you guys, this. guys, another scenario, and I was just trying to find these items, and I looked over. I'm like, who the heck took my little head wrap and my little booties right here? Pootie did, you guys. She literally took both of them and ran off into the living room and was dragging them through the house. Like, girl, mind your business. Like, leave my coupon stuff alone, girl. Like, you've got, like, 50 million toys in there. Anyway, <laughs> so... <clears throat> This was a whoopsies transaction, and I don't know if it's because I was sick, because I'm out of it. I don't know, but it was an accident transaction regarding the Revlon. So with the Revlon this week, they're buy one, get one half off, and when you um, buy two, you're going to get a $5 register reward. However, there's a, I believe, a month-long deal going on. I'm looking for it in the ad right now. There's a month-long deal going on with the Revlon as well, and there's tags hanging up in the store with certain Revlon items. Um, and it's, I believe it's the Super Lustrous Lipstick. And when you spend, I believe it's $15, you're gonna get a $5 register reward slash Catalina dealio. Um, so I didn't spend $15 though. I don't know what I was thinking. So don't, don't do these two items because you're not gonna be at 15 and you're only gonna get back that one register reward which is right here for the Revlon items. You're not going to get that second one back. So pay attention more than I am. That was a whoopsies on my part. Had I done this deal better, this whole haul would have been basically under $5, probably 2 or $3 for everything. After you calculate what I spent and then the points I got back and the registry rewards I got back. But this was a whoopsies, okay? So these Revlon items, these are specific ones are $8.49 and they're buy one, get one half off. I did get these for my mom. Um, she wears this kind of stuff. So one was eight forty nine, one was four twenty four. Now you tell me, does eight forty nine plus four twenty four equals fifteen? No, ma'am, it does not. Okay, so I got those two items, and then I did get this knit headband um, for when it's cold outside to keep your ears warm, which was super cutesy. It was in the clearance section; it was not tagged. It was just sitting with a bunch of clearance stuff. So it's like, oh, let me have her price check that ninety cents, you guys. Okay, so ninety cents for this. And then I got back, I got these little booties right here. They are a medium. Um, these little booties were $1.50. So I got these with my transaction. And then I got two packs of bounty paper towels, $4.99 for this and $4.99 for this. So <laughs> with all these items, I just barely hit that $25 mark. 
I did use $3 coupons from one of our recent smart sources for these two Revlon items. And then I used a $1 coupon for both the bounties in this past weekend's P&G coupon insert. So I'm going to show you guys what I paid real quick. Here we go. So you see the two Revlon coupons and then the two bounty coupons. My total after tax was $18.65. Now, if you guys don't know, you can only use so many points in one day. And since I use so many for those big, or I'm sorry, the Sharpie Expo items, I could only roll 2,000 more points. So I used 2,000 points. I paid 16 out of pocket. And I did get back that $5 register reward for the in-ad booster for these items as well. Okay, my crazy deals and steals family, for those of you that made it all the way to the end of this video, all the way to the green screen, you are greatly appreciated. So right here, you're going to see thumbnails for other, other videos on the crazy deals and steals channel that you should be watching. Both of them are haul videos. One is for the CVS haul from Sunday, and one is for Walgreens haul Sunday. Both are excellent. The Walgreens one has more clearance finds in it. So you definitely want to check both of these out. And coming up next for this channel, we're going to have a Dollar General deals video posted on the 27th, which is Thursday, as well as a CVS. CVS and Walgreens deals videos posted Friday and as you know that CVS and Walgreens haul video will be posted Sunday early a.m. before you guys even head to the store. If you haven't already be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.